ever watched my channel, you probably know I'm not really a fan of the Mortar Monkey. So, a modder by the name of Matsy took it upon themselves to make an insane buff to the Mortar Monkey. Specifically, the biggest one. So today, we're gonna be seeing what would the Mortar Monkey would be like if it was completely overpowered. Actually, we have to play on the Prime Mortar Monkey map, okay? We gotta do the good old fashioned space map, okay? And as well as that, you gotta make sure you play with Striker Jones, who is absolutely the best hero for Mortar Monkeys. He allows them to just go crazy on him, okay? This is the map that you just only use Mortar Monkeys on. So it'll be very interesting to see how good this is, okay? I am just like, look, I feel like I'm just not a fan of Mortar Monkeys. I always feel like there's a better tower to do the job, right? Like, I always feel, let's see, bigger radius, See, you don't- you have to get all the way up to Balloon Buster before you can start getting two pops at a time. But that's also not too bad. I'd love to know, what are your thoughts on the Mortar Monkey? Is it good? Is it bad? Well, I do know. It's bad, okay? I'm sorry to be the guy who speaks truth, okay? I'm sorry to tell you all the way- the way in which the world works. <laughs> but I have to speak the truth, okay? The Mortar Monkey just to me is just not that- it's just not that, like, exciting to use. Also, I wish it had, like, a better targeting priority. Because some, like, you have to click to set target and you're, like, constantly trying to move to have it go. It'd be interesting if there was, like, certain upgrades that allowed you to, like, target where it would hit. Or make it just, like, way stronger. Maybe, like, the biggest one, they make it so it shoots much more slowly, right? Like, it doesn't shoot really fast, but it's just a nuke. Where it's just, like, BOOM! and just like constantly wipes the map, okay? It'll be very interesting to see what the final upgrade of this is, the biggest one. Because apparently the modder is like, yo, like I made this wild, all right? Crazy. So we're gonna make this tower just super, super duper strong. I'm actually down to try to use all, only the mortar monkeys because it can hit all three types. So we should, I should definitely try that. So let's go ahead and just get increased production, greater production. I don't know when you get rushed with black balloons. I actually have no idea. It's probably gonna be very soon. It's probably gonna be super duper soon. But we do have Striker Jones, which makes make all black balloons less resistance to explosive damage from all monkeys. So we can already do a decent amount of damage, which is nice. But what I wanna make sure that we can do is get increased accuracy and Bernie stuff. There we go. Is Bernie stuff better to get faster attack? Probably so, just so Signal Flare can wipe them out faster. Right? Like, I think that's the better option. I think the biggest one, increased accuracy and Bernie stuff's actually better for the biggest one. Because everyone's like, you gotta get Bernie stuff with the biggest one. Bernie stuff in the biggest one is like, that's like the way to go, alright? That's the important strategy, alright? Let's get Signal Flare, and now we can actually get rid of Balloons, so we're doing all good. We're doing all good. Let's get Rapid Reload. Oh, we cruising now. We cruising. Look at that. No balloons can get by. We've got the ultimate strategy. Okay, it's not the ultimate strategy. All right, it's definitely not that great. All right, but I'm trying to get over my my dislike of the mortar monkey. Okay, I'm I gotta understand the mortar monkey more. Okay, if there's something that you don't like in your life, even if it's a person or a thing, you should try to understand it more. I think that's really important. In life, when there's something that, like, makes you angry or makes you upset, I think it's important to try to understand that thing more. Because I feel like, in my life, it seems like when I really understand someone and, like, look through their perspective, I start to, like, see it a lot more clearly, right? I gotta give it a real try. Try out the different paths, and then also mod it so it's super duper powerful. I think that's also another good option. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get another Mortar Monkey. This will be our middle path as well. Rapid reloads. Not that, like, it actually matters, because I think we're just trying to save up for the biggest one. Because I think that's, like, we gotta get the, the modded biggest one. And then just go to, like, round one million. Okay, I doubt we'll be able to get to round one million. Okay, I don't think that's gonna happen. Let's get heavy shells and stun balloons, because I think that mixed with shell shock is actually gonna be a pretty good combo. I actually didn't know that heavy shells does more damage to stun balloons and more and shell shock stuns balloons. So that actually seems like that'll be a pretty cool combo. And then we can just get big bigger blast and balloon buster. All right, let's go ahead, let's buy the big one. Seven layers of balloons is not shabby. Like, that's not too bad. Especially with when we got Striker Jones here. I mean, sorry, Octo Jones. Bomb shooters, neither hero, get 5% range and 25% hero. 
Pierce. Well, that doesn't help because we have just mortar monkeys. So that's not that great of a strategy. But you know what? We take all things. Oh, wait. Do you think we can deal with a Moab? We can totally deal with a Moab. There's no way we can. I refuse to say that. Oh, we might not be able to. All right. I got to get artillery battery. All right. Target. Target. Okay. There we go. Yeah, so we we had to target, but after we targeted them and changed it, we're good to go. You know what they need to add as a monkey knowledge to balloons that would actually make mortar monkeys crazy? You know how bomb shooters or darling gunners have like an ability that you can click on and then all darling gunners unlock and then point for you? It should be a similar button for mortar monkeys that when you click it, it targets all mortar monkeys to that one spot like central targeting location maybe even if it's like a t4 or a t5 of like pop and all or something right but if you get this ability you should be able to target all mortar monkeys to shoot in one spot or make it a monkey knowledge where you can like have group targeting where you click on a button and click and then all mortar monkeys target there i think that would be really cool that's something that I would like to see Ninja Kiwi at. Because I feel like that would be so cool. All right, let's go ahead. I guess we can just get more, more of these because we're doing pretty well right now. We can upgrade more of these to central markets. And then we just cruise through with some money. Let's see. I probably should get shattering shells at some point too. That would probably be nice. But nah. All right, see, now we can just use artillery. Ba oh, okay. Artillery battery is pretty cool. Artillery battery is not too shabby, actually. And we also have this ability so we can actually refresh artillery battery. Our boy Octo Jones going crazy on the balloons, okay? All right, let's go ahead and get shattering shells. And now the last one that we can get is the biggest one. Apparently the biggest one is, it's no longer the biggest one. Like it is the biggest one, right? The biggest one. This is gonna where we get into the modded part of it, where I'm so hyped, we need 38,000. Do we just go right forward to, to see how crazy it is? I want to see. Okay, before we get the biggest one, I want to. I'm gonna give the mortar monkey an authentic try, right? I really want to do my best with it. So, pop it off. Yep. Do more damage to bads and boss balloons. Main attack gains additional bonus damage to stun balloons. So actually, the more. So if they are stunned, it does more damage. So our boy Octo Jones can stun them and it does even more damage, which is pretty cool, actually. Now we got to save up and get balloon incineration. And we're already cruising. I actually think we're going to be doing just fine. Now with just these three, can we defeat like a round 95, right? Like how far can you get with just these towers? Is this a like, a, can you beat chimps with this? Like, I don't know. I don't think so. I want to believe it. You might be able to, actually. I have I have faith that you can. All right, there we go. Now we got the biggest one, and that's just dropping tons of fire. So the last one is the, wait, we got balloon incineration. The last is the biggest one. Okay, BFB, let's see. Oh my gosh, that got annihilated. That got absolutely destroyed. All right, we need to see, we need to actually get some like spiciness up in here, okay? So let's see how far these towers can get without the biggest one, and then we'll see. So stun, artillery battery, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. All right, the real question is can, all right, let's go to like round 91. How does it do against round 91? Not bad. What's getting the majority of the pops? I mean, Bernie stuff, like balloon incineration does pretty good. And the fact that it takes away Fortified is not bad as well. Like, it's pretty good. Octo Jones is level 20. All right, round 95. Round 95 is notorious for being insanely difficult. So let's see how well this does. Oh, wait, you can actually just spam this ability too. Okay, and artillery. What? Okay, can we? Oh, we're striking Jones. Can we beat round 95? Holy cow. Wait, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. There we go. Nice. We actually beat round 95 with just these towers. That's actually pretty crazy. That's pretty crazy. I was not expecting us to beat round 95. With Striker Jones constantly using his stun, it's kind of good. All right, let's just stun him. Look at this. And they can barely move, too. Refresh it. Do it again. All right, that was round 95. 
or 97. We're on 98 now. We haven't even needed to get the biggest one. I am pretty flabbergasted, not gonna lie. These towers have been doing really well. What happens if we, do I even wanna try to get an alchemist? I actually wanna see, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Artillery battery, artillery battery, come on, no. It was so close, look at how close it was. As long as you're using Striker Jones' ability, you're fine. And then you just like wipe out the balloons, it's so good. All right, round 100. I have both abilities on cooldown, unfortunately, so I don't think this is going to work out for us. But I'm down to give this my, like, best attempt. Alright, put that over here. Target this over here. And now, artillery battery. Do more damage to the BAD. Come on. Come on. Wait for it to pop. Wait for it to pop. Use it! No way! Come on, beat the V80! Alright, throw them all over here. Throw them all over here. Throw them all over here. Stun it. Wow, we beat all of them. And we didn't even have the final T5. We didn't even have the biggest one. And we were able to beat round 100, which is pretty crazy. I'm kind of flabbergasted with that. But now it's time for the biggest one! Boom! What? Look at it. has got, like, arms and stuff now. It is actually huge. Okay, alright, let's sell all of them. Except the biggest one. Wait, all right, how, how, can anything even get in? Okay, so anything that just gets in there just immediately gets eviscerated. All right, so, all right, nothing's even getting through. What if we just skipped 100 rounds? Like, literally straight up 100 rounds. All right, fortify. What? What? All right, wait, wait, can you, like, can you put a permabrew on it? Yeah, you can put permabrew on it. And it's even stronger no way. Wait, I shouldn't have gotten rid of Striker Jones. I want Striker Jones because I think it'll actually give him more damage, which is which is absurd to think. But we mu it must be done, okay? It must be done. Bigger radius? Okay. Wait, does it have the jungle drums? It does. Alright, jungle drums is all it needs. But we can also get homeland defense. 500. The balloons are getting a little bit further, but not even close. Like, still not even close. What if we just do, like, round a thousand? That's kind of insane to me. Round a thousand still, like, is so crazy. What is happening? It's got three billion pops. This is a good buff. I think this is a fair and balanced tower now. I think Ninja Kiwi should release this tower as such. We're only on round a thousand. Like, that's not too crazy, right? Okay, round two thousand. It's actually beating round 2,000. Oh, 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 oh. No. It was so close. It was so close.